For the Daily Commercial News in 90, I'm Lori Farfaglia. Leesburg High School has retired the first female jerseys in the school's history. Pearl Johnson and Bailey Bridges are former Leesburg High School basketball standouts that led the Yellow Jackets to three state Final Fours, and when they wrapped up their careers, Johnson in 2008 and Bridges in 2012, they were the school's all-time leading scorers and had earned All-State honors. Leesburg City Commissioners recently approved the $1.6 million needed to do improvements to Ski Beach. The improvements will include a boat ramp and possibly a restaurant on the water near the boat docks. Lake County may come to residents with hat in hand this November asking for a nickel per gallon gas tax to help pay for road construction projects. The county estimates the tax could raise $6 million per year, with Lake getting $4 million and the rest split among the cities in the county. The $2.3 million 9,800 square foot resource center in Leesburg will have a teaching kitchen, computers, and social workers to help residents in the Carver Heights and Montclair area with a variety of problems, but the main goal is to reduce the number of child abuse and neglect complaints in that area. The City of Leesburg recently received recognition from the Florida Recreation and Park Association for improvements made to Rogers Park at Venetian Gardens. For more local news, check out dailycommercial.com. That's this week's Daily Commercial News in 90 on LSTV. I'm Lori Farfaglia.